hello everyone welcome to Tony talks welcome back to Tony talks to all our beautiful subscribers we say thank you so much for staying with us and if you're new here we are happy to find us please don't forget to like subscribe and uh, it's on that notification bell so you will be notified for more upcoming videos in the comment section please note the regret there will be great three comments. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Stay safe, stay blessed. I love you all. Bye. My people, so VDM was arrested. And VDM never made mention of it. He never told us. Now they want to drag him to court. For coming out. For standing for someone. For crying out for someone. They want to drag him to court. There is nothing like freedom of speech. They don't want anyone that can stand for somebody. They don't want anybody that can be the voice. Once you come out and they are in power, they want to use their power, they want to use their connections to squeeze you. But one thing is for sure, VDM is not that beef that they can chew and just swallow. If you successfully chew VDM, you will not be able to swallow. Because VDM is made and made of something you and I, we cannot define. Now listen to how VDM explained how he was arrested and how now they want to charge him to court. Listen to this, my people. Hey! Alright, so first of all, I felt you say they say they won't arrest me. Now, they don't say they won't charge me, go court. Wonders. Now a lot of you didn't know I was arrested. Um, that one no really, I no really talk about them um, mm. because of um, a publication when I make about this man, Emeka D. Ebo. So before I talk with him happen that day, make I first talk this one. Dear Emeka D. Ebo, I just want you to know. What? So you know, he be politician for this country as long as I did this Nigeria. If they see your poster anywhere for this country, I go mobilize boys, they go tear around. You see that Anambra state where you won't contest for power, you cannot get it there. Now, under this your post, the last party where you contest under was under Abga to represent the Demili North what and South is? Federal constituency in 2023. You cannot be a politician in this country as long as I did here. The only way you can be a politician is when you pay what you owe. So all this talk of saying I won't carry me go court, Mona carry me go court. I won't go to a court. Now I also the year say they say you get connection to DIG, Deputy Inspector General of Police, DIG Alabi in particular. Say now I make you the spread. Number one, I know that is a lie. I know that is a big lie because I know DIG Alabi as somebody of integrity. That's an high caliber man. That's a man that is very respected in the Nigerian police. Of all the DIGs, you see him, see Frank Kumba. I never get the opportunity to meet the rest. But those are the people where we say we know them. Do you understand? So this DIG Alabi now, where they say, now they make you the spread. This is somebody, I know how many cases we don't carry go give DIG Alabi. And how we don't help solve all those cases. Even when you won't give him a token, he you know the collect. They say now nah, you person like the will not bring himself down to be party to all this kind of nonsense. And after this video, I'll still go to his office and tell him that does he know that they are using his name hmm. to abuse power? I will go to his office after this video. Now let me now tell you guys what happened and how I was arrested and what happened when they arrested me. So I got to the station. They came to my house. They arrested me. I reached station. I said, "Wait, what happened?" They said I made a publication what about this? this man where I said he collected money from somebody in the U.S. and he came to Nigeria to use the money to do politics. They said I should write a statement on that. Now, I wrote a statement and I said, "With the proof I have, all hand points." Say this man do this thing. And as a patriotic citizen of Nigeria, I will not be there when I what see is? somebody that is allegedly fraudulent 
is trying to gain office in Nigeria. So imagine if that person mm. gains office in Nigeria, it will cripple our nation now. People like that don't have any business in, 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 in countries' economy or in countries' power. While I was writing the statements, they can't show me one picture of one guy. They can't say, do I know this guy? I said, I don't know him. What Under the is... picture, the person they wanted him and I'm in America. I said, I don't know him. They say, look at the picture very well. I said, I don't know him. They say, who is the person that complained to you that this maker the Ebo collected his money? I say, the person complained through somebody else. However, I've spoken to the person. They say, where is the picture of the person? I showed them the picture. As I showed them the picture, coincidentally, the picture match. The only difference is say, what the guy is... now don't get hair, he don't get beards. You understand? They say, make I write. Say, I know this guy mm. as a fugitive in the U.S. I say, why would I write that I know him as a fugitive in the U.S.? The guy cried to me that Emeka Diebo was living in the U.S. with him. And Emeka Diebo brought his child to him so that he could go to train in child for computer studies. What does? So, as in the train, the guy picking, Emeka Diebo come pitching an idea. Say, make them gather money together. Make them come secure contracts for Nigeria, government contracts. Say, make them pay for the contract. Government will give them. When they execute the contract, the gain where they on top, they will split them. The guy asks him, say, is he legal? The maker, they will say, yes, see the legal. According to the guy. The guy saying, pack in life savings with his wife savings because he's a teacher. He makes money. Pack with his life savings. They give a maker, they will. The maker, they will come Nigeria. Come use the money wrong politics. According to the guy. Now, the reason why I got interested in the case is because... Why you go want to use why you go carry person money can't do politics, person life savings. So which one is our money do? Do you understand? So I can't narrate the story to them. They can't still say make I write, say the guy yes. they wanted in Nigeria. Now ask them a question. Now I say if he's wanted in Niger in, in, in America, is he wanted in Nigeria? They know if you talk. Hmm. And again, in my mind, I'm like, wait, if this man knows say this guy is wanted in the US, why did he collect the money of a wanted person? If not that he actually too follow be in two of them they in cahoots but no good talk at the end of the day as they say go no go they release me what i does? come back coded and not talk about the thing now that they say they won't charge me go court on top of the matter we go go that court the only way hmm? me i go keep quiet eh? now if you pay that money but if you don't pay that guy that money eh? you don't feel do politics for nigeria i don't tell you i don't put water for my account you rattle gangs for an umbra state when I go DRT. Because be like say again one guy man where won't come on a state, won't come run on a treasury. Mm. Mm. Be like say again one guy man won't come that state come run on a treasury. So you make a dear boy, they tell you who oh, are now, may you know. So I don't fear to go court. I don't fear to go court at all. Go go the court. The defense for defamation is justification. What Let's go there. The proof they my hand. Push come to shove. Go tell the guy I make on Nigeria. Mm. Make on tender and proof for court. But unless you pay that money, just kiss anything where consign politics for Nigeria. Kiss and bye bye. We go even write to Abga. We go write to your political party. They cannot put you anywhere near politics in that state. And to the people of Anambra, yes. be familiar with this face. If you use this one and they start in career, imagine what it will happen to Namoni mm. if he eventually become what he wants for that state. So, you make a dear boo, I will see you in court. You go and learn. Bring your what connection, no worry, I'll do it. You will learn the hard way. Bring your connection. <laughs> Bring your connection. Mm. Don't play. Now, Abuja, we did now. Now, men, they run out. Bring a call. More go call. Lawyers, plenty. <laughs> you're going to learn. And you're going to learn the hard way. Don't play. The worst mistake as a politician to do is to drag a youth who is bringing out facts. Because by the time everything comes out plain, that political position that you are looking for, you might end up losing it and then lose your integrity credibility in the mud hope is clear you guys gonna learn and you all learn the hard way <laughs>